Taurus, welcome back to Angels Light Tarot. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your weekly love message for October the 7th through October the 13th. Angels and guides, we're pulling out all the positive energy that we can for lovely, stable Taurus. All right, Taurus, what is going on for this week in your love life? What is going on? Yes, 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 in your love life. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What is going on? Thank you, thank you, thank you for Taurus for these seven little days. Yes, yes, yes. Hmm, very interesting. <laughs> okay, all right, angels. Let's get some love. Let's get some hearts on the table. Hmm. Do, do. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. What is going on? In the love sector, in the heart chakra. There we go. There's a heart. <laughs> okay, so Taurus, what's going on this week? All right, so we have the High Priestess, Four of Spades, Three of Clubs. Hmm, I feel like someone is definitely using their intuition. Yeah, someone is definitely using their intuition in your relationship. You might even be keeping something from your partner. Yeah, but you know, whatever this is, it's like it has something to do with the home, something to do with security that you're a little bit worried about. And I don't feel like it's, I don't feel like it's, you know, it's not, it's not like a love triangle or, or anything like that. It's about, it's something about the home. It's definitely something about the home or the security in life that you are worried about. Maybe your partner didn't know you were worried about certain aspects of life and you've just been kind of, you know, biting your tongue. Okay, you've just been kind of, mm, my partner doesn't need to know, blah, 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 blah. I'll just keep this to myself. But, you know, but I feel like you're worried about it. I just feel like you're worried about security in some way, and you're not telling your partner about it, okay? Now, let's look in the recent past. Maybe we can dig into this and find out where this worry came from. Okay, so in the recent past, you had the King of Cups reversed with the Six of Diamonds and the Ten of Spades. So in the recent past, the King of Cups is reversed. So someone, I feel, maybe isn't being as loving as they used to. Maybe someone isn't being as... Mm. Good morning, babe. You know, I'll see you later, babe. You know, maybe someone isn't giving that type of emotion out right now. I feel like they could be more focused on um, on the money, on the money, the relationship, and the finances. And maybe they're working a ton, a lot. Maybe they're working a lot, right? And you're not, you're just not getting all the love. Well, this was in the recent past. You weren't getting the love that you felt you deserved, okay? Because somebody was focusing more than something else. Now, let's look into the middle of the week. We have the Page of Wands reversed with the Five of Diamonds and the Eight of Clubs. So, the Page of Wands is like, I feel like a message is coming and I feel like this message is about going somewhere, maybe on a trip, maybe changes in finances, but whatever it is, the message does come and you guys are both um, privy to this. You're both in agreement. Maybe you are uh, taking a trip and maybe you're planning something. And I feel like I feel like this is the week or maybe you had been planning something or talking about planning something. And I feel like you're trying to move forward in that. Now, by the end of the week, by the end of the week, we have the strength card and we are missing angels. We're missing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We are missing one message. Yes, we are angels. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Actually, I think it stops there. Okay, so by the end of the week, you're not worried anymore. You don't have to worry anymore because it's like you don't have to put up that guard anymore. You don't have to be strong anymore because you know what? There is strength in your relationship. Your relationship is very powerful and it is financially protected. How awesome is that, okay? Now, now, your bonus, your bonus is the death card. There's something that's going to end in your relationship so that something can begin. I feel like with the five of, um, the five of swords, I feel like someone, 
um, is walking back into your life. It might be a third party situation, third party being maybe um, family member, maybe mother-in-law, sister-in-law, something like that. Yeah, I do feel like someone's walking back, coming back into your life. And with the king, you guys' life. And with the king of swords, I feel like you're going to reverse. I feel like you guys are going to handle it with kit gloves. You're not going to be Attila the Hun. No, 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 no. Your love is going to be very peaceful. And even you two are going to be very peaceful in this return, whomever is returning. But I still feel like there's some worry. You guys have a you guys have a, a bit of worry this week. Definitely a bit of worry. Um, now remember, I want you to think of worry as it's it, it is a negative energy, okay? And we don't look at it as when we think of negative energy, we think of something you know dark and scary. No, 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 no. Worry is a negative energy. Yes. So we're gonna. I, this is. It's like. You can worry or you can do something creative. So if I, in my hand, if I have the energy worry right here and I don't want to worry because you know worry turns into sickness, it turns into mistakes and things of that nature. So if you take out the worry and you put in something creative, like, you know, maybe you want to take up knitting that week or maybe you want to take up um, some kind of physical um, apparatus that week or maybe you're... Um, painting, singing, poetry, things of that nature to release the worry. I don't see why, well, I do see, maybe there's someone, who, whomever this is that's coming back into your life that, that caused, I feel like whomever this was, did cause a little bit of drama in your life, and here they are again, and but this time you just you guys are handling it differently, you're handling it more in a loving nature, and I want to say not worry about it, but in a creative way. So kudos to you guys. Um, financially protected. What do you, I feel like the secret, this thing that you've been worried about with security, I feel like you don't have to worry, but it's kind of like it's been down inside of you for such a long time. And it's almost like you're not even sure what you're worried about, but you are. Um, leave a comment below. What is it that you're worried about, Taurus? Because truly, you have nothing to worry about. Even when, even when someone comes back into you guys' life and causes a little bit of drama, I feel like you guys can still handle it with like kit gloves. You guys, you know, have the strength to overcome anything. You guys are financially protected. Everything is right there. So it might be worrying, Taurus. Um, just for the sake of worrying. So take that worry, put it in a basket and put in and replace it with something creative, okay? So I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent you.